If you're having trouble keeping your canister filter primed, or if you're having trouble priming your canister filter, here are a couple things to look out for. First, you wanna make sure that your canister filter is positioned below your aquarium. This allows the pump to work more efficiently because it has help from gravity. Next, you'll want to check to make sure that the valve lever is in the open position. Check to make sure that your tubing connections are secure on all ends. Make sure that your input bar connections are fully submerged under your water line. After your canister filter is primed, gently tilt your canister filter front to back, then side to side. This will release any trapped air inside your canister filter, which may be affecting your flow rate. Once your unit is in its desired location, you can improve the efficiency of your flow rate by shortening both your input and output tubing, which removes any extra bends, kinks, or loops, which can slow down your flow rate. When cutting your tubing, it's always a good idea to leave yourself a little bit of slack in case you need to move your components around in the future.